Hi, today I'm going to show you how to create a title screen and a lower thirds using color and gradient from your video footage that you shot. Um, here today as an example I'm using footage that I shot at the Tempe Festival of Arts and I'm going to take the color from the banner and make that into my title screen as well as incorporate that into my lower thirds. So I already have Premiere and opened and my footage loaded in. What I'm going to do is I'm going to match the colors in this banner here. So I'm going to go down here and click on the little post-it looking um, piece right here. Click on that and click title. So I'm going to start creating my title first and we'll go into the lower thirds. So once I have the title, uh, new title box open, click OK. And then I always like to move my box over on this side and move the footage that I'm matching over to here. That way I have um, black screen to work off of and then I can also match the color over here. So we're going to click on background and then click the pointer button right here on the filler, fill type. So we can do it by solid as you see whenever I move this around it starts that color. But what I want to do is click on gradient just kind of match the watercolor of the banner. So I'm going to do a four color gradient. And now I'm going to do different colors for each one. Again, get my pointer tool. I'm going to start with this box right up here. And I'm going to go over here and choose one of these colors. So I think I want to do, say in the pink tones, I'm going to choose this one. And then I'm going to go down to the second box. And again, hover over and the pointer brings up different colors, so I think I'm going to go a little bit lighter, right about there. And I'm going to do this for all four boxes. Just kind of varying the color so it looks like a gradient. And there, that's going to be the background to my title screen. And now once I have that, I'm just going to add text and I can then adjust it to any font that I would like and move it around. Once I've exited out of my title screen I'm going to see that it comes up over here with my other media footage and then just drag this into video one. And then once I have that set I'll drag my other footage over and now we'll work on the lower thirds. I already have my interview set up here, um, my footage loaded in, so I'm going to go the same way that we did last time. Um, go to that sticky note, go title, hit OK. And now this time we do want to see what we are working on. We don't want to work on a black screen because we want to be able to set up the lower thirds. Drag this over here while still being able to see my footage. So to create the lower thirds, first I'm going to start off by creating a box with the rectangle tool. And so I want mine to bleed off screen and we can adjust it after, but I always make it bigger and then make it smaller once I figure out the text. So now that I have my box, I'm going to go over here and again with the fill type, um, it's set a solid, you can do solid, but I want to do another four color gradient, just to kind of match. And I'm going to go over it with the pin tool again. And same thing as we did last time, picking about the same colors, you know, I can mix it up a little bit, doing four different colors like we did. Making sure to grab that pen tool each time. This is coming out a little bit more purpley, you know, it can kind of be however you want. Go with that color. So that's my lower thirds and the box uh, gradient set. And now again, same like last time, go and add text. So now that I have my lower thirds set in here, again, you can change the font. Um, I chose kind of a calligraphy related one and adjust the sizes and add a title down here as well. So you're gonna exit out of that and then you're just going to drag the um, lower thirds into the video two. Kind of drag it wherever you want. And then you can add 
fades and all that type of stuff that you do with lower thirds, but now when you scroll over, your lower thirds is there, as well as your title screen back here. So that's how you add color from your video that you shot to your lower thirds and to your title screen. Kind of makes everything more cohesive and it's really great when you're trying to do something a little bit more fun such as an art festival. If you have any questions you can comment on this post and I'd be happy to help you out.